still here with Kaylin and now joined by V. It's great that these two are willingly sitting here with each other. If you've seen past reunions, you know things between them haven't always been so peaceful. Check it out. Yikes. <laughs> are you ready for this? What is your first impression when you see her face? Put yeah, she's pretty. How fat her face was. What, what was going through your head while he was watching it? And I just think his girl is looking like a hood rat. How do you even know that's her, his girlfriend, though? I've seen stuff online of them together. Her name is V. Let's remind everybody that V and Kaylin have never met. Let's deal with the elephant in the room, which is your concern about what you saw on the internet. Posting pictures, smoking a blunt through a gas mask is not OK with me. I wasn't even with Joe. When was that? Probably about two years ago. I wouldn't trust her, and I wouldn't feel comfortable calling her because I don't know if she's drunk or high. I think that's insane. Do you think it's fair to judge someone on first impression? Where are you getting that here? Trying to, for you to see V as a human being, as I a do. person. No, you don't. You see a cartoon character who is online posted. I respect oh, this. You guys all suck. Get me the out of here. I'm done. V, at some point you were asking Joe to go for a little more custody. Because I just honestly feel like he should have his son 50-50. Well, I don't understand why that would even be a subject of conversation. Why? I don't feel like you have a place to say anything. What? That's my opinion, especially after hearing that he has 50-50. I just think, why wouldn't I feel some type of way? Like, that's crazy. I really want to sit both of them down. Like, I don't even care how it goes, like, if I have to, like, ambush them and, like, just be like, you have to talk about the child support stuff. He really, she really was neutral. Like, she really saw both sides. If it wasn't for her, I don't think we would have done today. Kale. We're having a bit of a reaction. Mm -hmm. I mean, you two have been through a lot of ups and downs. Kale, what about that made you emotional? I think the custody stuff brought back a ton of feelings for me. Um, I'm not mad at her at all. Like, obviously, now I look back and I'm like, of course he deserves 50-50, and they do have a daughter together. So, you know, just like yeah. she said to me that she did it for, for Vivi, but I think V was under the impression at the time that I just gave up 50-50. Yeah. And I, and that I think we also had no idea about each other's situations. situations and lives. And it's like, I just moved from Delaware, I have my daughter. So I was like, I think it's fair that my daughter sees her brother just as much as his other siblings, you know? Doesn't it give you hope for you and Lauren? Um, I don't know. <laughs> Take a moment. How dare you? I just, V and I, V's a different person. I just, I don't know. Like, I've said this recently. Mm -hmm. My relationship and the ups and downs that I went through with Joe and V related to our immaturity and our ages. Yeah, our ages. <laughs> Whereas the situation with Javi and Lauren is different because it's who we are. We're adults mm -hmm. now. We are 27 and 20. I don't know how old Javi is. We're 27 and 26 <laughs> years old. So it's a lot different. But there's still a lot of room to grow. I mean, yes, there 27, is, 26. But I, I'm saying months, I will not be friends with her. Like, I'm telling you, this isn't a we'll see. I will be cordial with her because we have children that are siblings. But V and I grew up together. We did this whole parenting thing essentially together. She's been in Isaac's life since he was, what, two, three years old? Mm. We grew this up together. A there's a It's completely different. So I'm happy you're here today, V. I'm oh, really just... You. I do miss Joe, though. Why isn't he here today? He's just, he's so busy. He's in real estate, so he's constantly working. And I'm in real estate, too, so. He was just like, go have a good time, babe. So. <laughs> well, he was like, him. behave. Because well, <laughs> every time I'm with her, we're on our worst behavior. Don't blame me. Don't blame me. <laughs> Kale, what do you make V do? Nothing. We have a good time. <laughs> what is a good time? She's we... wild. <laughs> no, no, I'm just kidding. Where, where, oh should, my God. where should we look for you guys tonight in Times Square? Right. Yeah, they're going to be in Times Square. Can we tell them? Oh, yeah, I said plot twist. We're actually lesbians. Oh. <laughs> kidding. I'm kidding, of course. <laughs> it's love. It's love. Right. <laughs> so I'm going to interrupt the love fest Great. for a section. Oh. <laughs> Take us back to Joe's decision to ask for child support. Mm -hmm. What led to that? I think it was just him and Kale already speaking about taking him off. And then, like, it just not happening. So he was just kind of like... I will say he that... He kind of just wanted to grab her attention, really. Like, he was like, I need to do something drastic at this point so mm -hmm. that she knows this is kind of serious to me. I will say, though, that I did talk to my attorney about taking him off, and it was just kind of lax on his end as well. So when yeah. my lawyer's not really updating me, I'm not, not I wasn't, I wasn't asking questions. I wasn't mm -hmm. trying to get him to speed along the process. And so, I mean, I do take full responsibility for that. Do you worry that Joe may want more back child support? Yes. Yeah. 
Never. Never. I mean, I know the reason why Joe went and did it for the the initial reason. So, and Joe is just not. He didn't. He doesn't want her money. It, it like that's like not what. It sounds like a guarantee. It sounds like it is a guarantee. It is a guarantee. Like we spoke that's about nice. this, and yeah. it's not going to happen. Okay. So, be a little bit about you. Congratulations on the wedding, you Thank and you. Joe. Yeah. Finally. <laughs> It finally happened. Finally. Why were you waiting such a long time? Was it? Well, I wanted Vicky to come out in the wedding. So that was like a huge part of my thing. Kale, what are your thoughts on the wedding? I bawled like a baby. My family was like, is that Joe's baby mother? And I was like, yeah. They were like, she cried the whole time. <laughs> they were happy tears. It was so funny. And they're like, that was so cute. And I was like, I can't believe what? she's crying. And it was Wait, funny. Wait, why are you crying? No, it was really, it was a really like emotional wedding. I just love this relationship. You're gonna right make me now. cry. I couldn't wish for a better stepmom for Isaac than the Oh, oh my Isaac. gosh. Isaac. So I just I'm like, I couldn't stop across. crying. And across. Benching on makeup. That's what makes me cry. Everyone who's got makeup on, on I know, stage, what is wrong with you? I am weird this. This is so this cute. So I think this is <laughs> I think this was more monumental than when Drake brought out Meek Mill. <laughs> <laughs> and they made up a Meek Mill. We're the friend. teen mom. We're the <laughs> Meek Mill and Drake yeah. the teen mom. <laughs> stop crying. You stop crying. <laughs> <laughs> you cried first. <laughs> Okay, well, thank you so much to Kaylin and V. And V, please let Joe know that we miss him and we hope to see him real soon, okay? And after the break, we'll chat with Brianna and Devon about how he's becoming a better father figure for Nova. I need to make that touch up. Oh, why did you cry? I know, why? I cried so hard. It was an ugly cry. Give me the kisses. Yay, mommy! Give mommy good sugars. I don't like this. Mm -hmm. It's your birthday! Yay!